before this video starts I want to clarify something I thought that there was going to be a kind of a meat slash bone like of the tail beast form you'll see what I mean in the video but there's no such thing you really just get a five tail cloak or whatever tail cloak that is you don't get any being bones so I apologize for that hey guys coming back with another video we're back in shinobi life 2 for a new video and I'm going to tell you guys really the process of how to get a ginger how to become a ginger key or and like fight a tailed beast and also the things that come with being a ginger key such as like having um leveling up your tails kind of thing upgrading your tails getting more tails kind of thing so i'll describe all of that in this video but before i begin i got you guys with the new codes for 2.5 version 2.5 so let's get those out the way right away all right so first code we got rel vex or just like that um i don't know if i typed that too fast but rel vex capital rel the whole thing and then vex exclamation point it already said already used next one is rel sin no capital s just like that exclamation point i already used it last one is sub to rel game i don't know how they spell game just like that kind of weird way to spell game but it is what it is i'm too tired bro this there it is all right all right now time for what you know you guys have been here for maybe you guys are here for the codes but it is all right it is whatever so first things first you obviously got to be a pretty decent level actually you don't really have to be but i would recommend it because you could always snake gen dirty keys uh scrolls like you know i did shoot i'm gonna also put up clips of whenever i explain something say like i explain like snaking um you know scrolls and whatnot I'll show you a clip of me doing that. I'm pretty sure I did that in my last video. But anyways, uh, you're gonna want to know when Jinjuri Key spawn or Tail Beast or whatever you wanna call them, right? Uh, obviously they won't spawn guaranteed because they have a rarity. So say like the uh, Nine Tails, they spawn and the Leaf has one out of twenty. Um, and so get ready. Just get ready in here at like six o'clock, maybe six o five. Get in a Leaf server get ready boom either it says it spawned right on the timer like right up here or it doesn't say anything that means it didn't spawn so if it says something go go look for it all right it'll be usually it'll be in an open space very open space if you can't even find an open space you'll probably see kind of shockwave effects in the distance out of nowhere um just head towards there trust me it's they're not that hard to find at all once they spawn they're loud they're big and they make big effects as well so, and you'll just see everybody else running to it just follow the crowd no i mean now that you've gotten there right now that you found a beast you want to either attack it right i mean regardless you should attack it attack it or wait till it dies and steal the scroll <laughs> all right or you could do both you could attack it then you know you know rightfully get it because you attacked it i mean that's everybody's thinking you know they attacked it they get it but thing is three people actually get the tail beast so two people get it from doing the most damage so the top two people doing the most damage to the beast will be able to get it just for free you, you just get it you don't have to even touch the scroll and then the third person is the one who clicks on the scroll first uh I'm, and look at that you see this is a big open area bro that's got to be the nine tail spawn right there all right it's so big it's like there ain't nowhere else they spawn it, it's right there bro anyways sorry i got off track topic anyways so yeah that's that's three people three so three people get it you might be one of those people by either doing the most damage or sealing it so i just i just popped it okay i got one tail cloak um this is the five tails right now i have the five tails one so I, so to increase my numbers of tails you have to increase the level of your tail beast cloak or ginger key or your, your cloak right so my ginger key cloak is like level 600 something 
So if I want to be if I want two tails cloak, you have to be around 240, I think, 260 or 240. And when you become that, you'll be able to find out if you press Z, hold hold Z or just press Z and then the number one. Oh whoops. Z, uh, Z one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It goes on. It depends on what tail beast you have. So if you have the nine tails, you'll go up all the way to zero, I believe. And then if you're maybe let's say you're the seven tails, you'll be able to go up to the number eight, if that makes sense. Because I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys. So I could go the two tails actually, just like that. Then three tails, just like that. And these all have requirements. And then four tails. And then. So I'm pressing Z2 for the two tails. I'm pressing Z3 for the three tails. And then I'm pressing Z4 for the four tails. And I press and when I press Z5, it says uh Koku Jin, which is the tail be the, the fifth tail beast. His name. Um it says 760 required. So I'm not 760 yet, I I'm like 600 something. So not just yet. But when I press Z5, you think you would get to that fuse together and become one a, a synergy kind of thing. You know what I mean? When when Naruto and Krama, you know, they fist bumped and whatnot. But listen, this is what I think. So when I press Z5, that pops up. When I press Z6, watch this. It pops up another requirement. Right, right? But when I press Z7, nothing pops up. So Z6 is unlockable, meaning I think that's where that's that's the synergy part. That's where like the complete part where we you know fist bump and and our our equal, our friendship. You know we have a friendship going on. But when we press Z6, that's no Z5. I mean Z5 because you would think Z5 is the the synergy mode. But I'm I'm thinking I'm thinking the one before the one you think it is is the meat mode the bone mode i don't know it sounds so weird when i say the meat mode the bone mode okay you know what I'm, i don't know if i'm just making this sound like um making sense but i'm trying my best to okay so that's with upgrading and then one other cool thing you could do with your gin is going into the gin jerky room it's a pretty cool place i'm not too sure what you're doing it <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, I haven't been there just yet, but let's see. Let me see. Let's uh, you have to be in the mode by the way. So get in the mode, then do exclamation point gin room. Just like that. And your screen just starts to fade in. And boom, just like that, you're in your your ginger key room. And then you see the five tails right there, whatever you know. Whatever um tail piece you caught. You, uh, it's gonna be there. So yeah, I'm not too sure what you can I can do here now, cause you can't do much in here unless I'm pretty sure unless you're like, um, Jin, like your certain number. I think you might have to fight it. I'm not even gonna lie with you guys. I'm not even gonna lie with you guys. But yeah, it is pretty cool. It is pretty cool. And then to leave, you just do Jin room off. Just like that. All right, just like that. I'm gonna turn this off real quick. Also, I, I, I don't know if I told you guys this, but uh, when you when you go up tails, uh, your boost or the your stat bonuses on the right side go up. See, I went two, four, six, or or not. I'm sorry, I'm, I don't know what I'm talking about. But yeah, just like that. See, it just went up from. 1800 to 2300 for my HP. It's nice. Anyways, um, so yeah, that's really all of it actually. Cause from then on out, you're just gonna be upgrading it. Oh, did I tell you guys how to level up? I'm pretty sure I tell you guys how to level up. How to level up your um your stats? You just either have the mode on, or you level up your character by doing quests or using the log. Um, at a certain point, just having it on does not do justice. It just the XP grind is so crazy. It's like, bro, you have to do quests over and over and over. 
and over it's it's just it's so it's so much so yeah guys that should be all of the tricky i'm not i don't think i'm missing anything else if you guys have any questions about your cherokee leave them in the comments and i will try to answer them all right i'll try to answer them if you guys did enjoy you guys already know drop that like button come on come get 50 likes for this video 50 likes and subscribe if you're not ready we're heading for 16k or not 16 what am i saying bro 20k for 2020 and hit that notification bell as well if you subscribed and have not i'll see you guys in another video peace